Sakon the Thief, aka the Prancing Man, can be seen at night trying to sell these stolen goods which he took from the old woman. We can see him haggling with the curiosity shop owner, and once their transaction is done, he runs off feeling gypped, only having gotten a measly 50 rupees. On night 3, we can run back and try to purchase the stolen goods, and it just so happens to be the bomb bag upgrade for 100 rupees. That's a bit steep, and slightly more expensive than the bomb shop's price if they had managed to secure the goods at only 90 rupees. Now these series of events are a part of a larger Anju and Kathy questline, where Kathy peers through a small hole opening to spy on the transaction. Fun fact, the hole that he looks through pokes directly out of the giant golden armor in the curiosity shop. But wait. In order to reunite Andrew and Cafe, we have to let an old lady get mugged? Not on my watch. I'm here to protect the grannies. Give them a taste of the bomb mask. Oh. Oh. Oh no.